Right. So yeah, like I mentioned, I changed apartment recently. It's pretty nice. That might be why you're hearing a massive change in the audio quality if you are. Um, <coughs> oh, we did it. Okay, I don't need to look now then. Just did Sunny Villa. Let's do Sheila's Alp. I mean, I do remember liking playing as different characters, so I don't know why I have such a kind of like meh kind of feeling towards Spyro 3. Other than that, I thought the skateboarding was dumb. And <laughs> that I couldn't do it very well, as we saw in the last one. Probably not that bad, to be honest. So we'll see. If you don't think Moneybags is an evil villain after this, I mean, I don't know what to tell you. What is that accent? He handles very weird where everything is like kind of... As you would imagine a kangaroo to walk, so it's a bit more like she accelerates quite quickly and then stays at a fairly like... Yep. Oh. Wait, she has a slam. Okay, X and Circle do the same thing. Oh yeah, that's the slam. <laughs> Get wrecked. Sounds like pseudo German Dutch, and I'm kind of confused. Whoa! She can Hulk jump, holy shit. Shame I can't move forwards, there we go. Then you can go to the middle house. It's not. I don't really know what this is. Maybe Dutch? Maybe German, but it doesn't. It's like very specific type of German, which is why I'm misunderstanding it as Dutch. So like, I think that you do this, yeah, but it's not really German. It's kind of like a higher register. It's not really German. It's like some kind of like pseudo German. This is what German Americans think Germans sound like, rather than like how Germans actually sound. Oh, for <laughs> you. <laughs> it's wrecking the shit out of screens, like, while well, literally taking the piss out of their accents. Yeah, we don't know, really know what to tell you. It also kind of sounds Swedish. Could be Swedish or Swiss. Doing the chicken dance too. There's a guy drilling a lot of. <laughs> so what's great about my new build is there's hardly any people because I bought a house that's like a, I rented I didn't buy. Uh, I can't afford to buy. What are you talking about? I'm a school teacher. Uh, Hulk jumping across the map. I love how the gems became less and less related to the story and less and less important, but like they're still here for some unknown reason. Okay. Oh, she can swim. Kangaroos can't swim. That's crazy talk. Oh, we'll just kick him. Bye, Moose. 
Yeah, so it's great because there's nobody around, the lifts are empty, the environment's pretty empty around me, there's a lot of building sites on either side of me, they're still building the neighbouring houses and some of the houses are still being refurbed or furbed, first furbed, and uh, fitted. So it just means that I'm not having any like weird interactions with neighbors bug-eyed staring at me and being like, it's hilarious because you're white and all this this shit. So it's nice because, you know, there's no one here to be racist towards me. <laughs> so that's nice. But it's kind of sad that that's how I do it. Oh, it's dancing. Ooh. I was like, why did they give Sheila a do? It looks weird, but now I'm kind of like, oh, I'm glad they gave her anything. Oh. The friendlies and the enemies have horns when I'm not paying attention. I mean, so does Spyro. Squatters. Baba. <laughs> Just wreck him off the hill. Oh, I have to destroy the houses. That'll solve the problem. Housing crisis. Get wrecked. No one can stand up to this kangaroo. Oh, they're wearing lederhosen, so I assume they're trying to be German. It's not racism if you attack a European. It's then in good jest. Keep that in mind, Tumblr and everyone else. Rhinox are appropriating important German culture. Ah. Uh, oh, there we go. <laughs> I was like, oh, you've made a game that's uncompletable, great. Uh, huh. Nothing up here. Oh, because I haven't finished clearing. Character, vehicle, vehicle character. I think this is the game where you first control Commander Penguin as well, which is like... The Commando Penguin is the best thing that anything has ever been ever, so shut up. Her run speed could be better, and she doesn't have a charge move so that you can't hurry her up, so it's a bit like that's the only thing. But you know, I've always she's a fun character. They really needed some variety, I think, and I'm glad that they added it, but like at the same time. It gets to, you know, gives you the feeling of like, uh, no one wants another Spyro game, so put Spyro's face on it and just add a load of like, and the people hated the mini games, so, uh, and the power ups didn't do enough. Uh, let's, let's just add new characters. Yeah, she used to be like a real Argo kangaroo, and they've kind of sexed her up, and I'm a little worried. <laughs> it's like, who's this for? <laughs> just giving her personality, though, isn't too bad. Rather than just hilarious. Uh, hilarious, quote-unquote. Stereotypical Australian accent. If you wonder what I mean by Hulk jumping, it's a term that's used to mean jumping like the Hulk in Hulk Ultimate Destruction for traversal purposes. Because that was a big thing in Hulk Ultimate Destruction, which was a sick game too. We got the egg. We did 
everything. Everything. Oh no. It's the last five. Really gonna do this to me. Oh, I don't wanna. No, it's not worth it. I'm gonna tank the LP if I just sit here chasing after these things. I'll do it off the screen. Oh, that didn't look good. <laughs> She was not designed to fly through an archway because she has no wings, so that she just kind of sort of glides forward. Oh. This also means I have to go back to Sunny Villa to do the Sheila section of Sunny Villa, so we can do that now, or we can do a Spyro level. And I think as we just did Sunny Villa, I'm gonna go do Cloud Spires. Well, fuck me. Story is progressing. Oh god, Bianca's so much smaller than Hunter, that makes it even weirder. Sexual tension. No! This is devolving into furry porn, and I hate it. Oh, why? Is it just me, or is that girl who's covered in a fucking completely body covering cloak kind of cute when she's trying to roast my ass? And thus, simp culture was developed. Thanks, Hunter! <laughs> Sorry, I'm obviously being glib. Oh, man. If you want to hear about these amazing Korean banana-flavored ice cream bars I got recently called Malone... Meloni? Malone? It's a brand name. They do melon ones, that's why they're called Malone's. Oh, fuck me, I guess. Can we both be sure that? Oh, wing attack! Look at this Pidgeotto over here. It didn't even do damage! It just knocked me back. Or maybe it did, and I just ate a butterfly. Oh, you guys look like flying porcupines. <laughs> Good, I hope you never find joy. Game over. <laughs> Have you tried pressing the big red button that you, your people probably designed? Because I did, and I did it poorly. You're literally always hovering. They must be pretty strong. God, this, this guy is just ignoring physics and exertion. So, okay, Rhinox are pretty good because it's like, you know, name the fodder, name the base grunt enemy of Spyro 2, you can't, right? But everyone knows what Norks are, so it's kind of like, yeah, they really needed that. Okay, I'm, I'm being turned over to the Spyro 3. I mean, I only played this one once, and it was much later than the others, and I was kind of past it and a lot more cynical. But now I'm really cynical, and I've kind of gone back on it. So cyn cynicism is a bell curve, you know what I mean? It's like, maybe... What do you want, Zoe? Oh, really? You know, it's only been three levels and three games. Oh. oh no. No. If 
found out recently that Chinese people won't eat rum steak because it comes from the ass. And that really makes me go, wow, you guys are missing out on an amazing steak because of your immaturity. But then they're like, we eat chicken feet. It's like, really? You'll eat the face of an animal, the, the internal organs of an animal, but you won't eat the ass. Sure thing. That makes sense, but when does any culture make sense, right? Uh, so what should I talk about? You want to hear about Tekken 7? Because I want to talk about Tekken 7. I was listening to a podcast and they said, oh, whoa, season four of Tekken 7 was just announced. Can't believe they put, who was it, Kunamitsu back in the game. That's crazy. Oh, man, Kunamitsu's crazy. I love Kunamitsu. And I was like, what happened to Fakuram? And then I looked and he's been out for ages. Sure, whatever. <laughs> People wondering why I'm hashtagging every single version of Spyro 2 and every single video of Spyro 3 with hashtag fuck Bezos. It's literally because he's in every fucking LP video I've done. Oh no! <laughs> oh, it's okay. Like every time he pops up with like a level of like. They knew that he's annoying. And I love that. Like, he's a character you love to hate. He's such a bastard. And you know what a kid's video game needs? It needs a bastard character. It needs a real heel. Yeah, I know, Zoe. It's just I'm not good at it. Zoe's a nice name. Yeah, so I started, I bought, I had some spare money on my account for PlayStation Network Store, so I bought Farquharam, Craig Marduk, and Armor King, because that's basically the characters. Okay, it was just an egg. This was a weird level. I'm not sure if I like the color palette or theming, but it's fine. Kind of talks like Tails as well, the character. I guess, thanks. And now it's raining. Awesome. <laughs> Uh, oh, money, 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 oh, the fuck, all right, okay, I want to catch the name in there, they're back, they're back people. And they're in their classic kind of style again. Seemingly faster. Come back, you little bastard. It all feels a little slower and more flaccid. It's like everything. Is that me? Might be me. I lost him. Chocolates. Come back. No, sir. Sir. Oh. 
All that would eat up for nothing. Sir. I just want to talk to you about our Lord and Savior. Sir. Just want to egg it up. Please. Please. No. Oh, this content, people. Content. Oh, I don't want to see up his skirt when he jumps. That's weird. That's weird. I don't like that. I'm not a fan of thief upskirting. Oh! I lost him, aren't I? Oh, no, 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 no. Come in. Oh, oh shoot. I'm fucking hurt. Oh. The egg, you bastard. Give me the egg. Give me the egg, and I won't pull out the gun. I will use gum. God, fuck you. Look at him. You made me kill a duck. That was your fault. Not mine. Oh god, this is like gonna be ten minutes. Oh! Why are X and Circle opposite each other? Yeah. No, please. No. Oh no, don't taunt me. Na 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 na. Let me get my orthopedic ass after you. Am I supposed to super fly? Ah! No! You little shit, I was so close. Uh-huh. Uh. Where? Please. No. Oh. Jokes on you on catching up. <laughs> Please, I want to live. This is harder than some Bloodborne bosses. What the hell? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Where? <laughs> oh my god, really? Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Am I not, am I doing something wrong? Am I supposed to be cheesing him out somewhere? Fine. Jokes on you, bish. Oh, he knew. Yep. Oh, I'm, I'm getting closer this way. Or maybe it's just perspectives fucking me over. Oh no. No, he knew. He knew. He knew! Fuck you. We're gonna see if this is faster. Oh. How to zap inverted controls! No, fly, you fools. Now! We almost had him! Yeah, I didn't want to get that one, that's fine. This, this cloud is pure horror. J 
make. Um, let's be getting those. If you fly, Spox can't grab things as you go by. I feel like they just couldn't make that work for whatever reason. Ow. There's that stupid thief. He's gone. He didn't like the rain. Oh, he's there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Get back here, you little bastard. Oh, it felt faster. It feels faster. It's faster. Brian! You're not born wearing glasses. You're born with an eye problem. That's all you're born with. Maybe they're born with it. Maybe it's an eye problem. Okay, so now the question is how do I get up there without having to resort to uh, using the whirlwind? Uh -huh. I am getting... lost. Oh, probably that one. Oh god, there's so many. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. No, no, no. It's this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no. No, no. Oh. Right, right. Maybe it's around here. I saw some rhinox up there. I can do this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 <clears throat> so I played a lot of Fuck Around. I played a lot of Craig Marduk. Uh, turns out I'm really pretty good at cheesing out the uh, AI with Craig Marduk. Like, I'm actually pretty good at working him and using like all of his functions quite well, but he just, uh, I just don't really care for his fight style. I played a lot of him in Dark Resurrection on the PSP, and I kind of got burnt out on him, and I've always just been a bit like, uh, he's a nice kid nice character. He's a pretty interesting character, but he's not my favorite, you know? I'm not a Marduk main. Like, he's got some shit, though. You could do some really cool shit with him. Uh, it's just, he's not, he's that kind of weird space where he's not a grappler, like King, where there's a lot of technical shit. Or, yeah, Armor King didn't even have that much in comparison to King. You know, there's like stuff, but there's not like stuff stuff. That makes sense. Is this another skate play? How many secret teleport areas are there? see where I have to go first. <coughs> Farquharam's really good fun. I'm really glad they incorporated him because he's a very interesting character. Uh, well, I, I mean, he, he's just big, angry Thai boxing man, but like they really do fuck over the Thai boxing crowd in uh, 
Tekken quite a lot because they had Bruce, who was a really cool character, and then they just kind of go, oh, yeah, he's dead, fuck Bruce. And you're like, oh, I want Bruce back. And they're like, nah, Bruce is gone. Forget about Bruce. And you're like, okay, here's a hot new Muay Thai character. It's a chicken shit Filipino chick. And it's just like, she's playing that role. <clears throat> Nothing wrong with Josie as a concept, except that she's playing that, oh, I don't want to fight character, which is just really frustrating. And, uh, yeah, not particularly, like, what I wanted from the character, which is a shame, because I love playing Josie as a playstyle. I don't even mind her design, but I just, it's not the best for me. You know, and like, so I'm glad they added Fakaram, which is another completely different Muay Thai style, and I like that. This guy looks like an emoji. Oh, great. Oh, he's in. He's like, no problem, bro. So yeah, Fakaram's great fun. I'm not very good with him yet, but I'm learning his shit, and it's pretty good fun. There's a lot of option selecting, a lot of like stuff you can do with his moves. He can do a lot of damage quickly, as a lot of the Thai boxing characters in Tekken can. Ow! Oh! Seriously. Oh, hello. So that's nice. I played a little bit of Armor King and actually was a little disappointed because like I always preferred King, but I thought, you know what, I'm gonna learn Armor King. I played him in Tekken Tag 2, I thought, oh you know what, like I'll try him. Wow, this guy goes out real quick. Made a new song. It's like the plot of Spider-Man 2 again. little bit disappointed but there's some stuff there so I'm like oh well you know I'll give him a try and I'll try some armor king stuff later uh, yeah it's just there's a lot of cool shit um, I really want to get back into Tekken because I've always enjoyed Tekken so I'm probably gonna do some stuff with that later but yeah notice they got rid of the intro outro for each area too before they had a little intro cutscene of the outro in Spyro 2, and that's just gone in 3. Oh, time to change again. Half an hour already. 